we're going to be working with proportions, specifically proportions of the normal distribution. And you're looking at an example of normal distribution here on the left. In this example, half of the distribution is shaded, and so the proportion shaded would be 0.5. And as you may recall, proportions range from 0 to 1. 0 would mean none of it is shaded, 1 would mean all of it is shaded, 0.5 would mean half it is shaded. Let's get some experience with proportions. So we want to pick the distribution where 0.4 of it is shaded. Now we'll pick the distribution for 0.25 or one fourth of it is shaded. The distribution for 0.93 is shaded. So here we go. And you know, if I'm looking for 0.25, obviously it's going to be less than half. 0.33 is going to be less than half. 0.85, that's going to be what's more than half. And so sometimes that alone can help the answer pop out for you. And the purpose of this activity is just to become more familiar with what does it mean for 0.78 of a normal distribution to be shaded. And then we're used to working with, uh, you know, a circle, like what proportion of the pi is, you know, an eaton or something like that. So for those of you that are new to working with normal distributions, this kind of helps you to map on proportions to a normal distribution. After you've done a few of these at the very end, it'll let you know what percent was correct and your average decision time. And if you like, you can do the activity again.